Hey everyone, in this video I'm going to discuss the three separate vitamin infusion protocols that I've created. I've gone to multiple IV conferences, functional medicine conferences, learned about nutrition, done studies and research online and in our medical databases to ultimately come up with three basic infusion packages that I've created as far as a 10-step protocol to take patients through IV nutrition to heal a general set of issues that they may have. Um, and so my three protocols are under three separate categories. The, the first one is my mitochondrial restoration package. The second one I have is called an intravenous detox package, and the third one is an immune recovery package. So I'm going to discuss briefly about each in intravenous infusion package, and then I'm going to do separate videos about each one individually and go into a little more specifics and details about it. So to begin, our mitochondrial package is our uh, most advanced package. It's a protocol that I wrote in order to regenerate the, the mitochondria. We're finding that as medicine goes on and research builds that we're finding that most disease actually originates in the mitochondria. And it makes sense. The mitochondria are the tiny little pieces of your cells, the engines of your cells that make all of the energy. They make all of the energy for every cell in your body. Your liver creates um, energy out of the nutrition and then they put the energy in, in, the, in the bloodstream and that bloodstream carries the energy around to your cells. But your cells have to take that energy molecule and actually create energy that it can use. Your your cell does just doesn't just soak up sugar and then turn into energy it actually has to create energy through different pathways the mitochondria is the primary thing that makes energy out of the nutrition that we eat and so this this protocol is designed to restore your mitochondria which are quite complex little organelles we call them we call them organelles because it's like an organ inside of a cell so a baby organ um, is an organelle and so this infusion protocol takes you through lipid therapy is what I call it, where we actually try to regenerate the cell walls to your mitochondria. And the mitochondria, once they're regenerated, they make more energy and you will feel better. Um, conditions that have mitochondrial dysfunction, I've done other videos on things like brain fog, fatigue, muscle cramps, muscle aches, or getting sick frequently. Um, almost anything can really boil down to mitochondrial dysfunction. So that package works for anyone. We generally use it for some of our sickest patients. The next package is called my IV detox package. And this IV detox package basically takes you through high level uh, antioxidants and detox components in order to help you remove whatever toxins you may be struggling with. In functional medicine, we use the word toxins fairly loosely and it's used fairly vaguely on the internet. You'll see all kinds of things about detox. It's a big buzzword nowadays. And so what this detox infusion package is, is using is we're, we're using the actual human components that your body uses every day to detoxify and we're giving your body even more in order to keep detoxifying. So the idea is that many of our detoxification components are kamikaze. In order to get rid of a toxin, you have to use this molecule attached to that toxin and then you can urinate, pee, or uh, you can pee, poop, or sweat it out. But those, those byproducts, those uh, metabolites that we create in order to detoxify, they start running low because we're exposed to so many toxins nowadays. And so this intravenous detox package is designed to give you all those metabolites that you need so you can ramp up your detoxification pathways, you can get rid of as many toxins as you can, and then, um, and then you can start making your own detoxification components. So the package includes both um, B vitamins and nutrients that you need to create your own detoxification molecules, but then it also gives you the actual detoxification molecules you need to do the, the strict purpose of detoxification, those kamikaze molecules, so to speak. And so I, earlier I said that toxins are fairly, we use the word very vaguely. There's biological toxins, there's toxins in plastics and chemicals and pesticides and everything that we eat, consume, and are exposed to. And then there's heavy metals. Luckily, our body designed a detoxification process that can handle almost any chemical, but if we run out of those detox components, then we just can't work very well. So by restoring the body's ability to detoxify, you can actually get rid of any toxin, including biological toxins like mold toxins or candida toxins or bacterial toxins, in addition to all the chemical toxins out there. That's the detox package, or that's the, the second package that we use as far as intravenous protocols. The third one I call the immune recovery package. And the idea behind the immune recovery package, you've probably heard of it by now, is high dose vitamin C. And so high dose vitamin C has been found to um, boost the immune system. Everyone's known for a long time as far as emergency and vitamin C people always take for the common cold and to boost immune system. And so the high dose vitamin C is no different. The idea is that the body is not utilizing vitamin C 
very well, or it's not absorbing vitamin C very well, or something else is eating the vitamin C, which we commonly see on our organic acids testing. Many patients with yeast and fungus overgrowth in their bowels, they frequently have really depleted levels of vitamin C. And the reason for it, we believe, is that the yeast is actually consuming the vitamin C before the human can absorb it. And so this high dose vitamin C is intravenous. It doesn't give the yeast and fungus an opportunity to eat it or feed off of it, and it gets directly into your bloodstream. The high dose vitamin C gets vitamin C levels that you could never achieve naturally. So this is somewhat unnatural, both because it's intravenous, but also because it's a, a, an extreme dose compared to what you could get orally um, from eating oranges per se. So the idea here is that this extreme dose of vitamin C runs the system and actually stimulates the immune system directly, and, um, and that's how we get the immune boosting effects. We don't fully understand all the effects of vitamin C, we just know that it works really well. There's someone uh, recently that proved that giving vitamin C to patients in the ICU who are septic or have bacterial infections in their blood, uh, they do much better when they get vitamin C as part of their treatment. Now they're not doing high dose vitamin C in the ICU, but that's kind of to extrapolate it uh, if, you're, if you're commonly getting sick or the frequent colds or runny nose or whatnot, you may have a vitamin C problem and that's where the immune recovery package comes in. We frequently use it for our chronic Epstein-Barr patients. So if you're struggling with mono or ever had mono and you're worried that mono is ongoing and chronic and you can't quite kick that viral infection, um, and we can do lab testing to help you determine if you're chronic or if you're dealing with something else. If you're dealing with chronic EBV, then the immune recovery package is one of the things that you can do to boost your immune system. So that's a brief overview of the three different packages that we use, the mitochondrial restoration, the IV detox package, and then the immune recovery package. And in my other videos, that you, you will see, um, you can click each one and really go into the details about what I decided to include in each package and why they work. So go look them out.